All right, and now, let's get ready. Let's give a big round of applause. Welcome to the stage, Camillo. Thank you, thank you. Let's hang on. Let's hear for our announcer. Let me tell you, we went from Baltimore this morning, and boy, are my arms tired. Here's something to think about. I walked by a store the other day, and it said surgical supplies. Now, if a surgery is being performed somewhere, shouldn't that place be well stocked? I mean, really, do you want your surgeon stopping in the middle of the surgery and realizing, oh Lord, I'm out of staples. Uh, here, uh, pinch this, uh, hold this together here. I gotta go run and get some. I'm just gonna run to the store real quick. So listen, I'm not afraid to admit I'm on a couple of online dating sites here. And uh, I got a message from a young man this morning. And he says, uh, you know, how are the ladies treating you? And, and so I clicked on this guy, and he's obviously gay, which is fine. Uh, why is he writing to me? It showed him as a 53% match. That word. Now, shouldn't OkCupid okay software take into account the fact that I've clearly selected in my options I'm looking for a woman? Email? Shouldn't OKCupid okay software have taken that into account and before they decided that he's a 53% match? And even, even the number scares me. 53%? I mean, that's better than it's not, right? I mean, that's better than half. So OKCupid okay has decided that this guy is a better match than a lot of the women out there. What worries me. What is OKCupid okay trying to say? That's my time, folks. You've been a wonderful crowd. Thanks for watching. Tip the bill. Try your waitress. This is Wasted Tuition. Thanks. Hey, Tino. You gotta tell those people to hit the subscribe button. My man. Or else you don't eat. Hit the subscribe button, people. Don't you have a heart? Please, save this guy. I know. I love you too. Okay, Tom. Yeah, it's great. Where are you going?